Now, your local weather authority with Chief Meteorologist Jesse Walker. Welcome back, everybody. Temperature hit 83 for the daytime high today. That's a little bit above the average of 80. 98, the record high, though. We set it back at 1925. 65 was our low earlier this morning, but 41, a chilly record low. We set that back at the year of 1998. We didn't get much rain here at the TV station, 0.01. There were some widely uh, spotted showers and a few thunderstorms across the area today, but the majority of the day it didn't rain. And some of you, just like here, didn't get much rain at all, but the rain chances are going to be there this week. We're going to talk more about that in a second. Sunrise, sunset for tomorrow. There's the amount of daylight we have. River Stage in Terre Haute is pretty steady right now, just over 7 feet. Right now at the airport in Terre Haute, we're at 74, relative humidity high, 82%. Winds are southeast at 9. Pressure starting to drop again as an area of low pressure slowly heads this way. It's at 29.97. Temperatures pretty much low to mid 70s across the area, so it's pretty nice out there, although it is a bit muggy. Look at these dew points. When the dew points are above 60, you start to feel it. When it's above 70. It's pretty uncomfortable. 71 pairs, 70 Vincennes, 71 over in Robinson. So we got this summer feel to the air, and that's going to stay with us as we head through the week. On the water vapor satellite, <clears throat> you can see the spin down here, low pressure, lifting up into this area, and that's going to be a slow moving system. It's pretty much going to take all week to finally get through this area, and as long as it's nearby, it's going to bring these clouds and showers in. The typical afternoon evening variety will be the most likely times to see the rain. They die off at night, fire back up during the day, but we can't rely on a few showers pretty much any time. Here's the satellite and the radar. You'll saw, saw during the afternoon we had a few of these showers pop up, lift north, and it kind of died off. There's not much out there right now. On the Dorset Automotive Doppler radar, hard pressed to see much. As the night wears on, we'll probably see a few more spotty showers develop across the area. So here's the future cast. We're just going to let this play out for you. A few scattered showers are possible tonight as we head through the day tomorrow, especially in the afternoon. Then they'll kind of die off a little bit, then fire back up as we head into Tuesday afternoon. The movement on these will be from the southwest to the northeast as we head through time. And there we are getting into Tuesday as well. So it's going to be that pattern where we get these afternoon, evening type showers and storms. Rainfall coming up over the course of the next oh, 48 hours or so. Not excessively heavy. A couple places maybe a little heavier under some thunderstorms, but just to give you an idea on the rainfall. And after that, well, it looks like off and on chances of rain. I think once we get to late week, here's Friday morning. Once we get to, say, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I think the rain chances go down. We have a better chance of some dry weather as we head for the upcoming weekend. And that could be a break for us because it looks like it's going to be a fairly wet week off and on daily chances of showers and storms. Temperature-wise, here's the really warm air, and we, of course, are getting in on some of that. As long as we have some clouds and rain, it'll keep the temps down some. But see this? I think once we get into the end of the week, we'll see the temperatures increasing. And longer term now, this is June 14 to June 20, we're looking at temperatures near normal. But the big thing is this rain coming this week, even though it may be kind of annoying, it may have turned out to be a good thing because look what happens. This is June 14 to 20. Much of the country, including here, looks to be going into a drier than normal pattern. So, you know, we could probably use some rain, and we're going to get it this week. So for tonight, mostly cloudy. A few scattered showers will drop down to 68. Tomorrow, scattered showers will be around, most likely afternoon, evening, a high of 80. And then after that, pretty much a daily chance, scattered showers and storms as we head through the week. I think the rain chances will dry up some by the end of the week. And as that happens, it heats up. Highs on Saturday, once again, approaching 90 degrees, Omar.